The Disability and Business Technical Assistance Centers welcome you to the Disability Law Lowdown ASL podcast series. Show 23, Movie Theater Closed Caption and Video Description, DOJ Looks at New Regulations. Hello, and welcome to the Disability Law Lowdown ASL podcast. I'm Lori Mallory, one of your hosts today. Today we're going to be talking about movie theater closed caption and video description. DOJ looks at new regulations. Twenty years ago, in 1990, the Americans with Disabilities Act was passed. Think about the technology we have now compared to 1990. In 1990, we didn't have what we have today. At that time, most of us did not own a computer or a cell phone. We never heard of video relay service. Closed captioning on television shows was new. A lot has changed since that time. The U.S. Department of Justice, or DOJ, thinks that new regulations are needed that address new technology, such as computers and cell phones. One way they are doing that is by possibly revising Title III of the ADA. Title III is the part that talks about access to public places. Like movie theaters. For example, they are thinking about requiring movie theaters to show movies with closed captions and video descriptions. Video descriptions are audio descriptions of what is happening on the screen. So blind people know what's happening. The DOJ is thinking about several new rules like that. And trying to figure out the positives and negatives. of the new rules. Before the DOG proceeds with the new rules, they want to hear your comments. You, me, our deaf community. The new rules will impact us. You. Anyone in the deaf community Friends, family, interpreters, anyone can give comments and feedback. Some of the questions they want feedback on are how should they figure out how many movies? will have closed captions and video descriptions. It will take time to make these changes. So what are the steps that will lead to the goal? What are the current standards and technology?
to add closed captioning and video description to movies? Are people developing new standards in technology? That might be better. What are the pros and cons of movie captioning and video description? How will new rules impact small businesses? Should some movie theaters not have to follow the new rules? Should there be training available to teach people? About the new rules? These are just some of the questions they are asking. You can read more and learn how to comment at www.regulations.gov. You can also search for DOJ-CRT-2010-0007. To help you find it. You can also find out more at www dot ada dot gov for more information or to order copies of any documents call the ADA information line at one eight hundred five one four zero three zero one voice line or 800-514-0383 for TTY. It's really important for you and your friends and your family to help spread the word, to give your comments and feedback and your opinions about the new rules that they are thinking about changing. The new rules will impact you. Us, the deaf community. This is your, our chance to change things for the better. to help decide what the rules will be. Please tell others in your community, your friends, your family, about this opportunity to help make better rules. The DOJ really wants to know our feedback and opinions. Please hurry. Thank you for watching. Want to know more? Visit asl.disabilitylawlowdown.com. I hope you enjoyed watching this ASL video podcast. You can subscribe to the podcast so you never miss an episode. You can subscribe for free through iTunes or by going to asl.disabilitylawlowdown.com.
The Disability Law Lowdown is sponsored by the Disability and Business Technical Assistance Centers, or DibTAC. a network of 10 ADA centers around the country. The ADA centers provide training and technical assistance. On the Americans with Disabilities Act and other disability laws. If you have questions or would like more information, you can call them at 1-800-949-4232, and that's voice or TTY. The ADA centers are supported by a grant from NIDER. Host, Lori Mallory. Script writer, Jackie Brennan. Editor videographer, Beth Case. Sponsored by the DibTAC ADA Centers. Produced by Decker Labs.